How many have ever been to Hawaii? And what did you receive when you first got off the plane or the boat there? Hey, isn't that an incredible way to welcome people? Welcome people, yes, yeah. I don't have lays, but I have a few sets of beads here. Now, who'd like to be welcomed this morning? You can stand up or I'll just bring it around. Aloha. Here we go. Aloha. I don't see anybody standing up. Aloha. Children all around the place here. Aloha. <laughs> hmm. Aloha, Heather. <laughs> Aloha. Got two tied together here. We can't do that. Aloha, Bill. <laughs> Aloha, Linda. Welcome to the family, every single one of you. We are very fortunate in this church to have a wonderful way that we welcome people with this wonderful welcome bag. Some delightful things in here. Do you know what's in here? Would you be curious to find out? Treasures. Treasures. That's absolutely right, Lou. Bookmark. And there are some in the front and the back if you don't have one yet. Welcome to the Church on the Cape. There is a letter of welcome with our beautiful church picture on the stationery. There is the history of the Church on the Cape. There's a copy of the Upper Room. Wonderful way to share prayers and scripture with our visitors. And there is Hospitality Soothes Souls. And so the soothing gift of some lotion. And there is, you may remember, the picture of the church. It's okay if I open this one? for those who may not remember. Again, that same picture that's on the stationery. Beautiful, I'm gonna put that right here. Just don't forget to put it back in the bag before we give the bag away. Thank you. Oh, it's not done yet. What else is in here? Hmm. A pen that says, Church on the Cape, Cape Porpoise, Maine, so people will not forget us. And finally, there's a magnet with the Church on the Cape talking about stewardship and ways to live out our faith together. Welcome, aloha, to the Church on the Cape is what we're trying to say to visitors, to everyone who walks through our doors. Aloha and welcome. Let's pray together as Jesus taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen.